things about our situation. This is called the Forge. It's generating the dampening field that keeps Voyager and the other ships trapped here. Do we have any idea what's running that thing? Or why it's here? No. The Aetherians had no detailed information about it. For all we know, it could be a simple machine. But our main concern right now is finding a way out of here. This is Isodesium, a rare isotope that doesn't seem to be affected by the dampening field. Belana thinks she can use it to get repairs done and bring main power back online. Then, hopefully, Voyager can escape. The sensor info from the Aetherians shows that there is Isodesium nearby. Unfortunately, it's located here. What is that? The Scavenger's base of operations. These are the Scavengers. A loose alliance of survivors from the other starships trapped here. They survive by raiding other ships for supplies, like their attack on Voyager earlier. The Isodesium was most likely stolen from other ships. Looks like they use some of it, but most of it is scattered around their base. They probably don't know of its energy potential. It's imperative that we get the Isodesium and get Voyager functioning again. We don't know what other surprises we'll encounter here or what that forge has in store for us. Sensors show hundreds of scavengers on that base. All races we're familiar with. Klingon, human, Malon, and Hirogen. We're a bit outnumbered here, so we've opted for stealth infiltration and retrieval operation. They seem to have a transporter inhibitor field, so a team of five will be shuttled to the base by Ensign Paris. Once there, Ken and I will set up an extraction point. Monroe, Telsia, and Odell will split up and retrieve three samples of the isodesium each. When you're done, you will make your way back to the extraction point. That's it, people. Now get prepped and report to the shuttle bay. Good luck, team. We just finished replicating the new compound grenade rifle. I know it's a stealth mission, but you never know what you're going to run into out there. Can't hurt to be prepared. The primary trigger was the secondary one charges. You might want to test it out on the holodeck here first. Initiating program, Camelot.
Excellent. Deck 10, Shuttle Bay. Hey, Monroe, they're waiting for you down below. They're having some trouble with the docking clamps, but I think Salma and Lang are on it. I'll try it again. I've already tried it five times. They're stuck. The controls must have been damaged in the attack. Oh, great. Lang to Paris. I'm down below, but there's a serious exhaust leak down here. I can't get to the overrides. Hey, Les, can you send one of your men down there? If we can't get those docking clamps released, we'll be going nowhere fast. Sure. Monroe, you don't look busy. Get down below and see what you can do. So what's with that base? It's highly compressed seroton gas. It's got to be over 500 degrees. I don't think even your hazard suit can protect you from that kind of heat. That did it. Good work, Monroe. Good. Get back up here, Monroe. Let's get this show on the road. Tom Paris at your service. I will be your captain for this flight. I estimate a cruising speed of about two-thirds impulse power and an elapsed time of just under five minutes. All right, Captain. We're all set here. Okay, all aboard. This is your captain speaking. The in-flight movie will be... Captain Proton versus the Robo Zombies. Thank you for flying Delta Flyer Airlines, and we hope you have a pleasant flight. Gents, meet you back at the homestead. All right, this is a stealth mission. Avoid detection at all cost. However, if you do find yourself in a hostile engagement, defend yourself by any means necessary. En route to airlock three. Right, on my way to airlock two. 